No, this is Patrick. Hello everybody, welcome on in. Hope you are all having a fantastic Thursday night. We are here live playing something different. I got myself a Game Boy Advance emulator and we're going to be playing some Pokemon Leaf Green. Mix it up a little bit. Try something new. Hold on, is there no audio on this screen? Is there no audio on this screen? Hold on. The audio go away. Can you hear me? Where is the audio? Where is my audio? Audio. 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 There's the audio. That's better. Alright, now that we got that resolved. Anyway. Welcome on in, everybody. Hope you are all doing well. Welcome on in, Viri. Freaking undissolved. Nate Nick. Uh, anybody else? Anybody else? Streamlabs, as always. Yeah, hope you are all having a fantastic Thursday. We're trying something different. I've been wanting to play this again for a while, um, and I, I got an emulator today. So we're gonna we're gonna get started. Uh, before we do that, though, obviously, we also have Stream Raiders, so you can head on over streamraiders.com forward slash t forward slash reachpat. Place your troops down on the battlefield. You can place troops every 30 or every five minutes and we'll get this battle started in half an hour. All right, I'm just gonna skip through this. This is just the tutorial. The world which you are about to enter, you will embark on a grand adventure with you as the hero. Speak to people and check things wherever you go, be it towns, roads, or caves. Gather information and hints from every source. New paths will open to you by helping people in need, overcoming challenges, and solving mysteries. At times, you'll be challenged by others and attacked by wild creatures. Be brave and keep pushing on. Through your adventure, we hope that you will interact with all sorts of people and achieve personal growth. That is our biggest objective. Press the A button and let your adventure begin. Welcome back, Nate. Hello there. Glad to meet you. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People affectionately refer to me as the Pokemon Professor. Uh, I have an emulator on my computer, Nate. This world is inhabited far and wide by creatures called Pokemon. For some people, Pokemon are pets. Others use them for battling. As for myself, I study Pokemon as a profession. But first, tell me a little about yourself. Now tell me, are you a boy, or are you a girl? 
Let's begin with your name. What is it? We'll go with... Reach. A little difficult, uh... The controls are weird, so the A button is X, the B button is Z, the arrow keys are up, down, left, right. Start is enter, select is backspace, and then the left and right bumpers are A and S. We're just gonna go with reach. Yeah, and the word Pokemon is all caps, but it's just because of the accent. My name is Reach, yes. This is my grandson. He's been your rival since you both were babies. Mm, what was his name? Alright, who wants to be my rival? Who wants to be the rival? We can make the rival Pat. We can make the rival... Does Nate want to be the rival? These controls are wonky. Nate Nick? All right, Nate gets to be the rival. Nate was the first one that said he wanted to be the rival, so we're gonna go with Nate. Was it Nate Nick? Sure. That's right, I remember now. His name is Nate Nick. Reach! Your very own Pokemon legend is about to unfold. The world of dreams and adventures of Pokemon awaits. Let's go! All right, this is, this is really cool. I haven't played this game in forever. So we got our NES here. We got our bed, we got our bedroom. Posted notice. If you're confused, ask for help. Press the L or R button. There's the L button. Uh, alright, end. Hey, it's Mom. Hi, Mom. Right, all boys leave home someday. It said so on TV. Oh yes, Professor Oak next door was looking for you. Can I... Yeah, let's, uh... Make the text speed fast. I think that's all I need to adjust. Alright, let's go. Yeah, you're leaving forever to go use monsters to fight people. Bye! <laughs> Bye, Mom. Love you, too. What's up, Gary? What? It's only Reach. Gramps isn't around. Alright, we gotta find... We gotta find Gramps. Are you in my neighbor's house? No. Are you in the grass that I'm not supposed to go in? Hey, wait, don't go out. Where were you hiding? It's unsafe. Wild Pokemon live in tall grass. You need your own Pokemon for your protection. I know. Here, come with me. Hi, random neighbor. Let me just uh, go inside your house and steal your stuff. Yeah, sounds about right. Gramps, I'm fed up with waiting. Nate, let me think. Oh, that's right, I told you to come, just wait. Here, Reach, there are three Pokemon here, haha! -ha! The Pokemon are held inside these Pokeballs. When I was young, I was a serious Pokemon trainer. But now, in my old age, I have only these three left. You can have one, go on, choose. Hey, Gramps, no fair, what about me? Be patient, Nate, you can have one too. All right, who do we pick, guys? We got Bulbasaur. Squirtle, or Charmander. Which one, guys? Charmander? I was thinking Charmander. The, the very first time that I played this, my very first Pokemon was Squirtle. But I'm thinking of mixing it up. Can I just have that? No. You're gonna make me wait around for the story. Yeah, I should probably go with Charmander. Oh, I have to go with... It. I have to follow the rules. Alright, we'll go with Charmander. Do I want to give a nickname to the Charmander? Should I give a nick... I, I've never really bothered naming my Pokemon before. But I feel like I should just for this... game. 
I don't know what I want to name it though. Name it Pat? Alright. I actually don't I, I don't mind that. So we have Reach and Pat. Hey Togepi Max, welcome on in. Now you're sus, yes. Alright, so we got a Reach and we got a Pat. Nate got the Squirtle. Alright, let's see if I can leave. Nope. Nate wants to try to beat me up in the lab. Rival Nate would like to battle. Sent out Squirtle. Reach sent out Pat. Oh, for Pete's sake, so pushy as always. Reach. You've never had a Pokemon battle before, have you? A Pokemon battle is when trainers pit their Pokemon against each other. A trainer that makes the other trainer's Pokemon faint by lowering their HP to zero wins. Rather than talking about it, you'll learn from experience. Hey, Daniela, welcome on in. Try battling and see for yourself. Alright, so we're gonna fight. And Growl doesn't do anything useful at least, so we're going to use Scratch. Inflicting damage on the foe is the key to any battle. It was a tie, Daniela, so I decided to go with Leaf Green, at least today. We're just going to keep spamming Scratch until Squirtle dies. Squirtle doesn't know any water-type moves yet, luckily. There we go. Gain 70 XP. EXP. Defeated rival Nate. Unbelievable, I picked the wrong Pokemon. I mean, the first battle doesn't really matter, because there's no type advantages really, right off the bat. Excellent, if you win, you earn prize money and your Pokemon will grow. Batter other trainers and make your Pokemon strong. Okay, I'll make my Pokemon battle to toughen it up. Reach Gramps, smell you later. Alright, bye Nate. Alright. Get good, Nate. Can I leave yet? I can. Oh, battle time. Going against Rotata. We're gonna scratch our heart out, guys. I don't think I have any Pokeballs, so I'm not gonna be able to do anything. Let me just double check real quick. Yeah, I have nothing in my bag. Yeah, so this is a remake of the original Pokemon game. The original ones were red, blue, and green. And this is a remake. This came out in 2004, I think. I looked it up before stream. Yeah, this is this was my first ever Pokemon game. All right, we learned Ember, so now we have a type advantage move. That's useful. I never realized that these were supposed to be cliffs until I played some of the newer games like it makes sense that they're cliffs because you jump down them but I just never recognized it based off of the graphics al alone all right so this guy's gonna want to battle us but I don't want to battle him so we're just gonna ignore him I don't have running shoes so unfortunately I can't go any faster yet all right now what do I do uh-oh. He's passed out. Oh, Grandpa, don't be so mean. Oh, I'm sorry. He hasn't had his coffee yet. Private property. Can't go through there. I think in the Japanese version of the game, he was passed out drunk, if I remember correctly. And they changed it so that he just hasn't had his caffeine yet. So that people wouldn't get offended. Uh, when the game was released in the U.S.
Found a potion, nice. Let's see, what do I do now that I'm here? I haven't played this game in so long, I don't remember anything. Oh, we'll go to the Pokemon Center. Charmander can get all healed up. Also, don't forget, guys, we uh, changed up our sound effects. So if you do exclamation SFX in the chat, you'll get a list of all of our new sound commands. And there's also a link to a website that you can use to uh, redeem your bot points to play sound effects right on the stream. Thank you for that, Viri. You know Professor Oak, right? His order came in. Can I get you to take it to him? Perfect. Can I get any Pokeballs? No, I can't get any Pokeballs right now. Can't get any of those right now, but we'll walk back down and drop off this parcel, and I think at that point we'll be able to progress the story a little bit. We're gonna jump down these cliffs. Oh, I should have talked to this guy earlier. Got a free potion. It's another Rattata. We are going to Ember now that we have an Ember. And I'm just gonna continue using Ember. Babushka! There is a babushka noise. Did you play the noise? I didn't hear it either. Did you play the noise? You did? Hmm. I didn't hear it. Maybe I need to adjust some of the settings. I tested everything out on stream earlier and it sounded okay. I think the game sound might just be too loud. Oops. Let me lower the game sound. There, let me try. Let me try. Yeah, that's better. Yeah, I think it was just a lot quieter compared to the rest of the noises. For some reason. I don't know. I didn't even realize that it happened. I didn't see the pop-up. Must be talented as a Pokemon trainer. What's that? You have something for me? Ghosty! Welcome on in. Ah, it's the custom Pokeball. I had it on order. Thank you. Ramps. I almost forgot. What did you call me for? Oh right, I have, a re I have a request for you two. On the desk there is my invention, the Pokedex. It automatically records data on Pokemon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. Reach and Nate, take these with you. We got the Pokedex, guys. Now we have a mission. You can't get detailed data on Pokemon just by seeing them. You must catch them to obtain complete data. So here are some tools for catching wild Pokemon. We got five Pokeballs. When a wild Pokemon appears, it's fair game. Just throw a Pokeball at it and try to catch it. This won't always work, however. A healthy Pokemon can escape. You have to be lucky. Make a complete guide on all the Pokemon in the world. That was my dream. But I'm too old. I can't get the job done. So I want you two to fulfill my dream for me. Get moving, you two. This is a great undertaking in Pokemon history. All right, Gramps, leave it all to me. Reach, I hate to say it, but you won't be necessary for this. I know, I'll borrow a town map from my sis. I'll tell her not to lend you one, Reach. Ha ha ha. Don't bother coming around to my place after this. Oh, Nate, you're evil. You're evil, Nate. There's a couple, uh, there's a couple sound effects that I added to that board that I th think you guys will be excited for. So, feel free to spam sounds all night long. Grandpa asked you to run an errand? Gee, that's lazy of him. Here, this will help you. 
Okay, we got the town map from Daisy. Somehow I, I, uh, I must have got there before you, Nate. Oh wow, the, uh, the NHL season just started yesterday, but one player has already been, uh, already been suspended for two games. Guess what time it is? Uh-oh. I'm nervous. What time is it? Waiting until this battle's over? Here, I can, I can pause it real quick. I can pause it. Alright, Nate, what, what time is it? I approve. It's always time for Fibbage 3. You guys will have to try to figure out which which sound effect is my favorite sound effect that I put in there. Uh, pause is control P, okay. There's one on there that wasn't requested, but I put on there specifically Quack. because... Quack? No. Quack's a good one, but that's not what I'm thinking of. See those ledges along the road? It's a bit scary, but you can jump from them. You can get back to Pallet Town quicker that way. Battle time. Ooh, it's a Pidgey. I like Pidgeys. This one's uh, only a level 3, though. Yeah, I like that one too. That, that that's a good one, but not not my favorite. Oh, I almost killed it. All right, let's try to catch it, guys. Let's try to catch the Pidgey. No, I don't have any Pokeballs. No, oh, yeah, I do. I just need to scroll over. Ah, ah. I'm remembering. Slowly. Alright, we caught a Pidgey. Common sight in forests and woods, it flaps its wings at ground level to kick up blinding sand. Give a nickname? Alright, who wants to be... Who wants to be Pidgey? Who would like to join our adventure? I'll just name everything Nate. Every single thing that I catch is Nate. Just to be very confusing. Wait, how come Pidgey can have more letters in its name and I can't? Rigged. I think I need to I need to name it Rigged at this point. Yeah, the Bruins are really good at getting penalties, Viri. I don't know what you're talking about. Um, I don't, I don't, I, I'm also a huge fan of naming Pokemon other Pokemon's names. I had somebody catch a Zigzagoon one time and name it Pikachu. Just to, just to throw stuff off. So I think maybe I'll do that. I'll just start naming stuff other names. Alright, so our Pidgey's name is Growlithe. Just to be confusing. I'm gonna have to do that for all of my Pokemon going forward. Every, every Pokemon that I have is gonna be named... Somebody else. We're in Viridian City. I wonder if we'll be able to find Viri here. Hello, townspeople. Have you seen a space fox? No, I don't want to know about the two caterpillar Pokemon. I still don't have running shoes, so... This is, this is kind of brutal. Aha! Now he's had his coffee. 
What's that red box? Ah, I'm working on Pokedex. Let me give you a word of advice. Whenever you catch a Pokemon, the Pokede Pokedex automatically updates its data. You don't know how to catch a Pokemon? I do know how to catch a Pokemon. Uh oh. Wild Weedle appeared. What would the old man do? Oh, we got a cutscene. What is he going to do? Going to throw a Pokeball. I already caught a Pokemon, old man. I already caught one. Anyway, caught a Weedle. That was educational, was it not? And here, take this too. Ooh, we got a teachy TV. If there's something you don't understand, watch that. It'll teach you about the basics of being a Pokemon trainer. Alright, bye, old man. Are we ready to go battle the first gym, even though we have absolutely nothing? I think the answer is no. We'll go back and we'll find Brock later. For now, let's take a trip up Route 2 and see if we can catch something else. Uh, I'm not sure if you can do percent. You should be able to gamble, Nate, but I don't think percentages work. Um, you can do any number between 10 and 10,000. Yeah, my bot doesn't like percentages. Nobody's done the sound effect yet. Alright, level 4 Pidgey, come on. We just caught a level 3 Pidgey. Pidgey uses Tackle. Oh, Nate's waiting. Nate's waiting for the right moment, I see. That grew to level 8. Oh, Viri doesn't want to play it either. Oh no, nobody wants to play my favorite sound effect. You guys are all mean. There's also the dogfish sound effect. If you're thinking about the dogfish sound effect, that's not what I'm referring to. We can Pokemon before attempting capture. When healthy, they may escape. Battle time. Almost battle time on Stream Raiders. We got nine allies. Could definitely use some more help there. Oh, it clears the chat whenever I... Let me fix that real quick. I don't want it to clear the chat whenever I leave the page. Alright, let's try to fight. We're gonna Ember. And one hit KO. Um, Nate, let me see what the cooldown is on that. I just turned everything on a little while ago. I'm not entirely sure how it works. Um, it's on a five minute cooldown, but I I just changed it to a, a, a one minute cooldown. For now at least, as long as people aren't abusing it, but if you're just hanging out, I don't really care if you if you gamble. Ooh, Nate just lost ten thousand points. I should probably switch in my Pidgey name Growlithe. So I can get that trained up a little bit as well. Let's see what's over here. Just a person. A thing! Antidote. So now I won't get poisoned. The only way you can recover is by gambling your 5,000 points. I mean, you gotta do what you gotta do, Nate. It's another Caterpie. I don't really want a Caterpie. It'll be good, uh, good training for my Growlithe. Hey, Nate, you won some points back.
Now, if I remember, this part's just very zigzaggy. I'm skipping all the trainer battles for now, just so I can try to level up a little bit, and then we'll hit the trainers eventually. Yeah, let me see what the settings are for the Gamble Command. There's also a slots minigame and a duel minigame, so you can, you can do slot machines and you can duel other people. Um, so yeah, if you get anything 50 or above, you get two times the amount of points that you gambled back. Um, if, you get, if you get a 99 or a 100, you get three times the points. Yeah, the slots are hard to win, but the payout's really good. So it really depends on what you're, what you're uh, planning on doing. Ow, tackle hurts. All right, I should probably switch to my Charmander to be safe. The way I have the slot set right now, as long as you don't get three jabated emotes, you're guaranteed to at least get your money back, I believe. Unless I'm just reading this wrong. I could be reading this wrong. Yeah. Ignore me, I'm wrong, I'm wrong. Hey, there's stuff. I like stuff. A potion. You were about to get debated. Yeah, that's true. It may have been intentional. So many bugs. I don't want any of these bugs. Go, Growlithe! That's not actually a Growlithe. I should have switched those back. Nobody wants to play the sound effect. I'll just sit here and cry. It's okay, guys. I'm okay. Uh-oh, I'm poisoned. Waiting till dogfish. There's another sound effect, Nate. That's not the one I'm referring to. Oh, I should probably... Use the antidote so Charmander doesn't die. And his name is John Stamos! Yes. <laughs> I'm so happy. I'm so happy I have that sound effect. You look away for a bit and something weird happens. That's what happens, Ghosty. You should you should know that by now. That's what happens in this channel. You look away for just a second and something weird happens. Uh, but for now, we're starting this battle. We got uh, 13 allies, 15 enemies. Might be a little tough. We'll see how this goes. Got a couple enemies left. Our troops are a little split right now, so I am a little worried. But I think we should be able to get this. As long as this top left group can just tank the rest of these hits, we'll be able to get these null slugs out of here. No problem. Yes, my my musketeer turns into a boat when it walks. Alright, we got six gold going to everybody who placed a unit in that battle. One viewer is getting two bomber scrolls on the leaderboard. We got Viri in first with seven kills. Nate is in second with five kills. And Kick and Kevin in third. Two kills, one assist. Loot is going to freaking undissolved. Congrats on that bonus loot. We're still making our way towards this token chest. We're going to head right to this battle here. This is going to be an easy one for some rogues. Get your rogues on the battlefield. Head on over to streamraiders.com slash T slash reach bat place troops. Every five minutes, we'll get this battle started in half an hour. But for now, oops. There we go. That's better. We haven't seen a Metapod yet. 
Metapod's just gonna harden at me a bunch. So, for that, I'm just gonna set it on fire. Alright, Viri, we'll see you when you get back. Hey, Impossible Fig, welcome on in. How you doing today? I forgot how different these older Pokemon games are. It's gonna be a lot more grindy than uh, than the newer ones because they don't have EXP share or anything like that. I'm doing pretty good. It's been a, been a good day trying out. Uh, I haven't played. I have not played Pokemon Leaf Green since I was pretty little, so we're... Oh, I did not mean to start a trainer battle. Oops. Yeah, I haven't played in a long time, so... We're trying it out tonight, see how it goes. This might be the death of me, guys. We'll see. Ah, I might just be able to one-shot everything. Leveled up. Nice, nice. I'm gonna send out a Weedle. I'm gonna stick with my Charmander. I'm just gonna keep using Ember and hope for the best. Yeah, to the graphics, they're scaled up right now, um, which definitely helps smooth the edges a little bit. But they're, they're still pretty decent. Alright, Kakuna and light you on fire as well. Bye, Kakuna. All right, level up. I was a little nervous going into the forest without uh, anything really, but I guess it's a good spot to grind anyway. So I'll just get my, my Charmander leveled up as much as possible. while we head back to Viridian City. I might as well just do the trainer battles. They're gonna be as easy as, uh, as that last one. As long as I have, as long as I have PP left on Ember, we'll be good. I think I'm going to need to grind quite a bit anyway before we battle Brock. It looks like I should just be seeking out the trainer battles. I forgot how much of a difference the trainer battles made compared to wild encounters in this game. Are you not going to battle me? Found a potion, perfect. Another Caterpie. I don't want to catch a Caterpie. I need to find something that'll help me against Brock. But I'm not sure if I'll be able to get anything in this area. I should probably just look up a guide that'll help me go through things, but I... I like the, uh... I guess thrill of going through it blind. It's not my first playthrough, obviously. Like I said, I played it when I was little, but... Maybe I could try to catch a Kakuna? See if I can level it up? But it's gonna be a while before it does anything. Alright, we'll try to catch it and see what happens. And if we catch the Kakuna, we have to name it... Nope, didn't catch it. Forgot how annoying Kakunas can be. They like to break out a lot. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna kill it at this point. Not worth fighting you, Kakuna.
Yeah, Beedrill would be nice, but... I think right now our better bet is to just try to level up our Charmander as much as possible. Found a Pokeball, perfect. Maybe that's one of the ones that I threw that uh, Kuna that he broke out of. I'm thinking possibly once I beat this game, I might reset it or pick a different uh, different game that I can play on an emulator and do a Nuzlocke run. I wanted to do this just plain to start so that I can kind of get back into the mentality of playing Pokemon because I haven't played it in a while. Especially the older games. They're a lot different than what uh, what's out there now. Okay, one shot a lot of wild Pokemon now. They don't really do anything for me. I don't have... Can I get the Versus Seeker in this game? Can't remember if I can get the Versus Seeker or not. Now we're gonna go heal up. Let's look at our map and just see kind of where we can go. We can go left, but I don't really want to go to Victory Road. There might be some higher level stuff over there though that we can grind on. I still don't have running shoes. I think <laughs> off stream I'm going to have to look up when I can get the running shoes. That'll be big. All right, let's see how strong the Pokemon are over here. Oh, it's only level two. Disappointed, I thought they'd be higher level. Hey, Alex Winterfox, welcome on in. Whoa. Nostalgic, yeah. No, I, I found an emulator today. And I was like, I... I need to play this on stream. Hey Nate! Off to the Pokemon League? Forget about it. You probably don't have any badges, do you? The guard won't let you through without them. By the way, did your Pokemon get any stronger? Oh, battle time. Nice pants, Nate. Where'd you get him? The pants store? I would love to figure out where to get the running shoes. I think I may be a little underleveled for this trainer, for this uh, rival battle. Uh, I don't want to put in, I don't want to put in my Pidgey. Ember's not going to do anything. We'll just use Scratch, Scratch for our lives. All right, keep. T t yeah, you got your pants at the pants store. I figured. Typical Nate getting his pants at the pants store. I just hope he doesn't use uh, Bubble Beam or Water Gun, but I think we're good. Yep, we're good. Get it after you beat Brock. All right, sounds good. I, I, yeah, I'm trying to level up a little bit before we go against Brock. We got Metal Claw. Metal Claw could be useful. Heard the Pokemon League is crawling with tough trainers. I have to figure out how to get past them. You should quit dwaddling and get a move on. All right, bye, Nate.
Ooh, Manky could be good. Yeah, we already walked through Viridian Forest once. Um, I was just trying to get some battles in there. Falcon, welcome on in. How are you doing, my friend? Don't look in the VOD from yesterday. I was trying to impersonate you, and it wasn't going very well. So, I think we, we, we cannot impersonate the one, the only, Guardian Falcon. Much better nowadays? That's great to hear. Yeah, I saw your post in Discord. I'm, I'm very happy for you. Extremely quick to anger, it could be docile one moment, then thrashing away the next instant. Like Viri, whenever anybody plays a goose noise. Alright, we're gonna name the Mankey Caterpie. No, we're gonna name it, uh, we're gonna name it... Machoke. We are, uh... We are intentionally naming all of our Pokemon other Pokemon. Just to be confusing. My trainer's name is Reach, my starter's name is Pat. Everybody else is uh, going to be named after a Pokemon that they are not. Alright, we got a bunch of underleveled Pokemon. You guys ready for Brock? I'm ready for Brock. Let's go to the gym. Pokemon gym is always closed. Wonder who the leader is. Brock, where are you? Where's Brock the next one? Do I have to go through Viridian Forest to get the Brock? I don't know what I'm doing, guys. Well, we're just going to keep going. I think this is where the game is telling us to go anyway. We can't go down Victory Road. We don't have the badges yet. I remember so very little about this game. I'm enjoying playing it as if it were my first try. Viridian's the last gym. Gotcha. I don't- I honestly don't remember where it was, Falcon. The problem is, like, I could do a better impersonation of you if I wasn't afraid of waking my girlfriend up. Because that's scary. And I don't want to deal with that. Um, but if, if I was allowed to be louder, I'd probably be a little closer. But if anybody is interested, we added a bunch of new sound effects. If you want to check them out, you can do exclamation SFX in the chat. That'll give you a list of all of our sound effects. Also a link to the website where you can redeem the sound effects right from that website. If you don't want to use the chat commands, you'll be able to use your uh, chatbot points to redeem for sound effects. So you can do exclamation points as well, just to see how many uh, how many points you have. We're even for some sound effects. We got some pretty fun ones on there. Oh, we got a Pikachu, guys. Yeah, don't wake up, girlfriend. Nope. We're just going to throw a Pokeball, because I'm afraid I'm going to kill it. Not... Oops, not what I meant to do. I forgot the keybinds are weird on this. Alright, I should probably switch to a weaker Pokemon so I don't accidentally kill it. We're gonna scratch. Yeah, I'm I'm significantly more ticklish than my girlfriend, so. She has a big advantage over me. Also, she's, she is short. She's just about a foot shorter than me, so she can just knock me over. Which has happened on multiple occasions. Alright, we got a Pikachu. What are we going to name the Pikachu? What are we going to name the Pikachu? Hmm. 
What's a good Gen 1 electric Pokemon? It is not Pikachu. You can name it Jolteon. Jolteon is a solid Pokemon. Alright, so just to recap here. We got We got a Charmander named Pat to complete the Reach Pat. We got a Pidgey named Growlithe. We got a uh a Mankey named Machoke, and we got a Pikachu named Jolteon. Did I use the music too? What music? What music, Falcon? Oh, we got another Pikachu. Oh, the Avengers music? Um, I don't think I have any Avengers music in there yet, but I should get some Avengers music. I'm working on... I'm working on adding more audio clips from other streamers that I know, so I want to add something for you eventually. We have a dogfish clip. Oh, you're not looking at me. Did you know that Pokemon Evolve? Yeah, if anybody wants to use, um, actually, why don't I do it? Dogfish isn't here right now, but uh, we we have a dogfish sound clip that I would play whenever dogfish shows up in the chat. So if he shows up later, we'll play it again. But there's this. Yes, can we get some hype in the chat? For the one, the only freaking sleeping dogfish. Yeah, I, I made that a couple of weeks ago, and I absolutely love it. So we play that whenever Dogfish comes into the chat. It was amazing the first time that he came in, because I was hyping it up for a couple of days. He just, uh, it was over the weekend, so he was busy. Uh, he didn't pop into the stream, and then the next stream that he came in, I was like, oh my gosh, I was in the middle of a, uh, an online game of Mario Kart, so I couldn't pause it. I'm like, wait a second, guys. Wait a second. We gotta... We gotta make this work. And then he popped it, we played it, and it was great. I salute you, good sir. That clip deserves these bits. It is too good. Holy crap! Falcon coming in with a thousand bits! Thank you so much, my friend! Oops. I appreciate those bits quite a bit. Not quite the same as when Dogfish does it. I would dance for you, but I don't have a webcam right now. I'm trying to save up for a stream deck. And then after that, I'll probably get a webcam. Yeah, all my, uh, all my alerts are Tiger's uh, Impossible Fig. Also, guys... If you guys want to see some different alerts, make sure you come back, check out our birthday stream in 10 days. Birthday is exactly 10 days from today. I have all new alerts, all new sound effects set up. We'll be playing a lot of community games. We'll be doing uh, the birthday event on Animal Crossing. We'll probably be doing some Mario Kart, some Jackbox games. Uh, and everybody is welcome to join, so if you want to come back, that is Sunday, January 24th, going live at 7 p.m. Eastern. Alright, let's set this Weedle on fire. How excited is Falcon about this? Ask my friend Thor when he sees Hulk. Yep. That is a good, uh, you'll have to, Falcon, you'll have to figure out what your, your favorite, like, either clip of yourself or clip of something that you do on stream is, and let me know, and I'll have to get some, get an audio clip of it, make it, make it a redeemable alert here. Alright, we are in Pewter City. Let's heal up and 
try not to get our butt kicked by Brock. I think I had a similar issue with my original playthrough of Leaf Green, where I would basically only focus on my starter. And what ended up happening was my starter was level... My blast always got to like level 90. And nothing else was even close. We need some help. We can talk later. Yeah, we can definitely talk later. Love them all and make me some more. Do I want to dream big? Do I dare to dream of becoming the Pokemon champ? I'm no trainer, but I can advise you on how to win. Let me take you to the top. Alright, let's get happening. First Pokemon out in a match is at the left of the Pokemon list. Changing the order. I, I, I know all this stuff. I know all this stuff. Oh yeah, the Jigglypuff's eyes. They were a little strange. Oh, I don't think I can skip... Oh, I can. I can just walk around. But I kind of want to get the extra experience from doing the trainer battle, so... We'll see how this trainer battle goes. See if we can level up once or twice. Camper Liam sent out Geodude. I don't really have a... Uh, type advantage here. I think I'm just gonna have to use my uh, my metal claw through this entire gym. It'd be nice if I picked uh, Squirtle. Then I could just use Bubble Beam or Water Gun. Oh no, I thought that would take him out. I was a fool. Well, this is what I get. Bulbasaur would be the best. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I always forget the type matchups. I'm so used to the, the newer games where it just tells me what's super effective and what isn't. We're spoiled. Change Pokemon? No. Go with Metal Claw again. Alright, Metal Claw doesn't do a lot of damage. I don't think Ember's gonna do any better. We can try. For science! Oh! They did much better. Bulbasaur is strong against Brock Misty, resistance against Lieutenant Surge. That's true, but isn't Bulbasaur like the least picked out of the three? I feel bad. Bulbasaur is always left alone. Uh, I should probably go heal just to be safe. So I don't get stomped. We still don't have running shoes. I think my favorite part of the newer games is having running shoes unlocked right at the beginning. Hello, creepy Jigglypuff. Goodbye, creepy, creepy Jigglypuff. Let's go for Brock. So you're here, I'm Brock, I'm Pewter's gym leader. My rock hard willpower is evident even in my Pokemon. My Pokemon are all rock hard and have true grit determination. That's right, my Pokemon are all the rock type. Wahaha, <laughs> you're gonna challenge me knowing that you'll lose? That's the trainer's honor that compels you to challenge me. Fine then, show me your best. Hey, Brock. Brock, send out Geodude. Alright, so we're gonna use Metal Claw to start. Ooh, that was good. I should probably just print out a type advantage chart. Now, I can't remember, does this game follow Gen 
1's type advantages, or does it follow Gen 3's type advantages? Because it came out between Gen 3 and Gen 4. I can't remember off the top of my head. I'll have to look it up. Gen 3 ones? Yeah, that's what I thought, because it came out after Sapphire and Ruby, but before Emerald. Ouch. Alright, hold on. Pokemon. And three type chart. Yeah, it was only for a minute uh, yesterday. Alright, let's see. Attack against Rock. Yeah, I think the only thing I can really do is steal. So I'll have to keep going with, uh... Metal Claw. Oh no, he attacked first. We're gonna lose! We're gonna die, guys. Alright, we'll send out our Jolteon. Unfortunately, I don't know the controls on the, uh, the emulator, else I would just go back to before we even got into the gym. I know we're going to lose at this point. Oh, hey, we got another hit on. That's not effective. I need a Voltorb that knows self-destruct. That would save me. Yeah, we did another hit point of damage, guys. Nice job. Well, if Onyx keeps missing, we'll keep rolling the RNG. Can I take him down one? Nope, never mind. Never mind. Schmibbles, welcome on in. Alright, we lost. That's alright. That's alright. Alright, let's see. Water, grass, fighting, and ground, and steel. Fighting is good? Or, what, did, I, did I misread that? Ground, steel. Fighting is good. Okay. If I just train up my Mankey, we might be able to get, uh... Might be able to make some progress. Alright. Bye. Lost on science TikTok again? Science TikTok? I'll be honest. I'm a I'm a bit of a of an old of an old person. I don't have TikTok. Can I not buy oh I just completely overlooked him. Alright, let's get some training done. Is there any good place to train around here? Nothing up there. Hourly water reminder, don't forget to stay hydrated. Just like sciencey things. Yeah, I don't know, sometimes like people just get you just get into a mood. I get lost on the internet quite often. Oh. No, I don't want to go with you. I don't want to go with you. Uh, while we're walking, make sure you place your troops over on the battle. It's actually just starting up now. Good timing, let's get that started. 21 allies, 7 enemies, just a couple of buildings. We should knock those down, no problem. Ghosty's knocking down the first house. Reach Pack getting the second house. Undissolve getting the third house. Possible Fig getting the fourth one. Oh, our rogues all died. Possible Fig getting the fifth. 
sixth one. Or the last two, if I miscounted. Two enemies to go, and they will go indeed. Let's open up that chest. We got five gold going. Everybody who placed a unit in that battle. One viewer is getting three flag bear scrolls. One viewer is getting three rogue scrolls on the leaderboard. Impossible Fig in first, six kills. King Kevin in second, three kills and an assist. And Viri coming in third with two kills. Loot is going to Ghosty and Kicking Kevin. Starting up the next battle right here. Power Converter. I'm not familiar with this particular map, to be honest. What units are good against those things? Got an unknown down here. Oh, they're, they're like busters. These are all just busters, guys, so we'll need some ranged. I'll put my monk down here. Just need to get some ranged units down, I think. You can place troops down on the battlefield every five minutes. And we'll get the battle started in a half an hour. Good luck, everybody. Oh, there's also troops up here. I didn't see these ones way up in the corner. Well, these are kind of high level up in the corner here. Uh-oh. They're hiding on us. Well, place your troops on the battlefield. We'll get that started in 30 minutes. I don't have the right stuff. That's why I was trying to go train, but thank you. Alright, where can I go train? I might as well just go back to Viridian Forest, I guess? Is there anywhere else that I can go train right now? I don't think so. I'll have to see if there's any more trainers in the forest that I didn't pass yet. I don't think I'm- oh! We're evolving, guys. That was quick. We just started. We haven't even been playing it. We, we've only been playing for about an hour. We're evolving. Alright, we got a Charmeleon now. Maybe I'll go over to Victory Road. That might be that might be a good spot to train. Wish I had the versus seeker. Everything in general would be so much easier if I just had running shoes. on fire like always. Super effective, of course. Let's see if we can run into any more trainers. like on the road to victory road there might be some slightly higher level pokemon we can grind a little bit but not much it 
it seems as if uh, Viridian Forest is going to offer us the same... Basically the same stats of Pokemon, so I, I don't think there's really much else we can do other than just kind of grind around a little bit. Set all this guy's Pokemon on fire, like we have been. I'm gonna switch to my Pikachu. See if I can get Pikachu trained up a little bit. Sorry, Jolteon. You're right, I meant to say Jolteon. My mistake, I, I misspoke. Oh, come on, Caterpie's paralyzed, but hasn't missed a single move. Rigged. Rigged. Alright, Growlithe, you can do it. Yeah, Schmibbles, we're intentionally naming all of our Pokemon other Pokemon names. Alright, well Growlithe is leveling up a little bit, but I didn't want Growlithe to level up, I wanted Pikachu to level up. Or sorry, Jolteon, Jolteon. My mistake, my mistake. You don't like that? Why, you don't like being intentionally confused? Can I battle you again? I need the versus seeker. trainers that I can go against. Fortunately, I don't really have that option, so we're just going to be grinding here for a little while. if we can get up a couple more levels, we'll probably be in decent shape. I should probably also change out to... Let's see, what's a normal type? Do I have any normal types? Normal flying, fighting, electric... Yes, with my choke in the lead to get a few battles experience in. This fighting is okay against rock. Oh, this is gonna be a long battle. Hold on, do I have do I have turbo mode? Yes I do. 
There we go. That's better. That was quick. Speed run. Speed run. Metapod. Alright, hold on. I'm gonna see if I can change the speed for the turbo mode because I feel like speeding it up at this point is probably a good idea just because of how much grinding this is. Um, not that. How do I change? How do I change? And yeah, we'll just leave it. I'll mess with it later off stream. For now, I'm just gonna be sitting here spamming the attack button. Alright, Medpod fainted. Oh, we didn't even level up. What a waste. What a waste. Alright, we'll head back up. Oops. I keep hitting the wrong... wrong, uh... hotkeys. A lot more grinding with these older games. I feel like if I was playing uh, Pokemon Sword or Shield, I'd already be halfway through the game by now. Imagine finding a shiny Weedle. Imagine being a shiny Weedle. I feel kind of bad. At this point, I probably wouldn't even notice. I'd just click right through it. Because I'm just trying to grind through these battles. I need the EXP share. Desperately. I'm spoiled rotten. I'm spoiled rotten from the new games. Alright, I got a Caterpie. Caterpie is no longer with us. Bye, Caterpie. Yeah, I was looking through a guide on my other monitor, and it was saying, oh, you shouldn't have any problem going through the gym with a level 20, or level a level 12 or above normal type Pokemon. Like, how am I supposed to get a level 12 normal type Pokemon when I'm getting, like, one one hundredth of my XP bar going up every time I finish a battle. I have to sit there grinding for hours to get something up like a normal, a normal type up to level twelve. I don't know. I think I'm I'm just gonna have to kind of headbutt right into Brock again and hope the Onyx has a bad uh, bad roll. Blue games one one Viri. Ooh, I'm gonna have to pull it up when I get off stream here. Let's see how much time is left. Let me pull it up real quick. If anybody is interested, Viri is a fan of the 
New Jersey Devils, and I am a fan of the Boston Bruins, and they're currently playing against each other. Let's see. Less than 10 minutes left in the third period. Ooh. I don't know if I ever saw a shiny on my original playthrough of the games. I caught a shiny Growlithe on Let's Go Pikachu, which is technically the same game as this, but I don't think it really counts. You know what we're talking about? We're talking about hockey. No, don't go, let's go, don't let's go Devils. Devil, the Devils are bad. Can I get any revives? Not yet. That's unfortunate. Can I take your survey? Hmm. Hold on. There's certain phrases that I could say to put into this survey, and it'll give me something. I need to figure out what the answers are. What, Nate? You don't watch hockey? No. Don't say it. Don't. Don't. No! Alright, I know that there's only a few people in chat right now, but I'm gonna have to ban, ban everybody. Tribbles, can you start getting on banning everybody in the chat, please? I think Schmibbles is the only Boston fan in here. Link together... Will... Well, because everybody else is talking about the Devils. You're the only one that's not talking about the Devils. Link together, Will all. Yes. No, that did not work. All right, never mind. I thought that's what I needed to do to get something. Apparently not. All right, Brock. I'm gonna, I'm gonna save the computer, the game here. And that way, if I need to load it, I can just load it. Brock sent out Geodude. Hey, Lacerte! Welcome on in. We're gonna try this again. We already lost Brock once. We got through Geodude, no problem. The Onyx is going to give us a tough time, though. The Onyx is pretty tough. But as long as we keep leveling up, we'll be in okay shape. Yeah, Schmibbles would steal the games from me. So she could play them. And then I'd come back to, like, playing the game, and it wouldn't be anywhere near where I had saved it. I was always so confused. Well, good. Rock Tomb missed. All right, we just need Rock Tomb to miss a couple more times. Nice, nice. There we go. I barely even took any damage that time. Let's go, guys. We 
took you for granted and so I lost. As proof of your victory, I confer on you this, the official Pokemon League Boulder Badge. Alright, we got the Boulder Badge. Just having the Boulder Badge makes your Pokemon more powerful. It also enables the use of the move Flash outside of battle. Of course, the Pokemon must know the move Flash to use it. And we got some money. And we got a TM. TM is good for only one use. TM39 contains Rock Tomb. I'm pretty sure they, um... If you follow Twitch on Twitter, they post the uh, who the Daily Pog Champ is every morning. Uh, they just don't have it on their website. All right, I beat Brock. Now, how do I get the running shoes? Gotta cut up to you, Professor Oak's aide. I've been asked to deliver this. Oh, there we go. I got the running shoes. Whew. Press the V button to run. To run. All right, bye, thank you for the shoes. Dear Reach, here's a pair of running shoes for my beloved challenger. Remember, I'll always cheer for you. Don't ever give up from mom. Aw, thanks, mom. Thank you, mom. Love you, mom. 2-1 Bruins, yeah! Excuse me, you looked at me, didn't you? That's very, um, that's very my girlfriend. You looked at me. You want to fight? Last Janus. Uh-oh. Falcon's not here. Falcon, I found Janus. I found Janus. I found Janus. Falcon. Janus is right here. Nate's being gross in chat, guys. I'm sorry you had to hear that. Uh, no. We'll keep, uh, we'll keep our... We'll keep our... Charmeleon. All right, bye, Janice. Uh, thank you for your money. Got a couple more battles to do over here. Hey, I saw you in Viridian Forest. Ah, and you would like your butt kicked yet again, Bug Catcher Colton. I'm going to light your Kajapi on fire, Bug Catcher Colton. Oh, they just tied. Ah, boo, boo. Weedle? No. These first few weeks of hockey are going to be kind of interesting because everybody's so rusty right now. Uh, they didn't get any preseason games because of COVID restrictions. So we'll see how long it takes everybody to get into shape, but... We'll play against the Devils eight times this season. Take that, bug catcher Colton. Right, is this youngster Ben? Oh, it was an own goal? That, that, that... Janice, what are you doing here? Falcon, I found Janice! Janice just came to say hi and then gave me her money after I beat her Pokemon. I'm really liking this set everything on fire strategy. Youngster Ben, yes. This is this is Youngster Ben. Is Youngster's name actually Ben? Or did he just get the name because he liked Youngster? Alright, we got a 
another trainer here. Found youngster and your bot in one stream. Yeah, crazy, crazy indeed. And we're gonna we're gonna set Greg's Pokemon on fire. No one can surpass youngster Joey and his Rattata, because, you know, he has a girlfriend. We're going to be coming up on Bug Catcher James in a little bit. Now I just need to find a Falcon and Dogfish. Exactly, exactly. There's no Sharpedo in this generation, unfortunately. But Dogfish likes Scyther. We found that uh, Dogfish likes Scyther. So if we find a scythe here, we need to catch it and name it Dogfish. We were in Viridian Forest for Viridian Space Fox. Did you know that Viridian Space Fox actually lives in Viridian Forest? True story. Viri actually lives in the real life Viridian Forest. That's how she got her name. She's just in denial. It, I didn't say Viridian Forest is on Earth, Viri. And I guess Earth is just floating around in space, too. It's all a matter of perspective. The look you gave me, it's so intriguing. Uh, last, last Sally, I was looking at a wall. I'm not sure what you're referring to. Last I checked, I walked straight up. You're the one that walked and looked at me. Oh no. I didn't one-shot it. That's unfortunate. Next, is this Calvin? Or is this Bug Catcher James? This is Bug Catcher James. Caterpie and a Metapod. That are both about to be on the fire. Alright guys, we got about uh, just under three minutes left in Stream Raiders. If you haven't placed a unit down yet, head on over to StreamRaiders.com slash T slash ReachPat. Place a troop on the battlefield. We'll be starting that shortly. Reading in the sport in the forest of the Middle East. She said she was in denial. Make up. <laughs> I haven't made up my mind, so I don't think I can help you make up your mind. All right, let's see if I can catch this Spiro. It's a level seven. Which will be the one of the highest level Pokemon that we have on our team. bugs in grassy areas. It has to flap its short wings at high speed to stay airborne. We are going to name you... Hmm. What are we going to name Spiro here? What is another flying type? Shibbles! Welcome on in! How are you doing today? What are we going to name our Spiro? Let's name it. When did we get the reply button? I don't know. Is it not standard? I'm not too familiar with it. I guess we'll just name it Pidgey. Can't think of anything else.
Growl at the Spiro. That's true. I was thinking of just sticking to Gen 1, but there's no need to do that, really. No, Ghosty, if you, if you look here, we got Growlithe, the Pidgey, we got Machoke, the Mankey, we got Jolteon, the Pikachu, and we got Pidgey, the Spearow. Hey, Belle, welcome on in. How you doing today? Yeah, no, I'm I'm intentionally naming all of my Pokemon wrong. Because why not? We're having fun with it. All right, well, we won that battle. Let's see if we can win this battle as well. Let's get this started. We got 35 allies on the battlefield. Not very many enemies, but the ones over in the top left are pretty high power. Uh, lots of level 20 circuits. Got a level 20 super bug and another level 20 circuit. Looks like our tanks are chewing through the circuits pretty quickly, but we still have this super bug to worry about. Looks like the right side is all taken care of. And that was easier than I thought. I was expecting, uh, expecting a little more resistance from those high level units, but I'm not complaining. Uh, we got six gold going to everybody who participated in that battle. One viewer is getting a musketeer scroll. One viewer is getting a barbarian scroll. On the leaderboard in first place is Nugs, two kills, two assists, Impossible Fig coming in second with two kills and one assist, and Nate coming in third with three assists. Loot is going to Ghosty and Schmibbles. Congratulations on that loot. This battle right here is going to be our last battle of the stream today. So head on over to streamraiders.com slash T slash reachpat. Place your troops every five minutes on the battlefield and we'll start this battle at the end of stream in half an hour all right we level up yeah i appreciate you stopping in bow how do i get my stream to look so professional i spend way too much time let's see should i use let's see I think Smokescreen is better than Growl. Um, I spend a lot of time off-stream just working on my overlays and um, different transitions and stuff. Have you seen my Stinger animation? Uh, hold on, I'll go, I'll go there and then I'll come back to this. Uh, but there's, there's a lot of tools that you can get online that are either free or... Uh, really cheap that you can use to improve your stream like I I made all my alerts myself just by finding pictures and um, images online that I can use um, I got all the sound effects from different games that I play I think it just it, it, it it's the, the big thing to remember is that it's always a work in progress uh, I stream with Streamlabs OBS. Oh, there's a Pokemon Center right here. Uh, but I've looked up a lot of different guides. I've talked to a lot of people. Um, I'm always I'm always messing with different things on my stream, so. I can constantly, constantly improve stuff. All right, let's see. Do I want to buy the Magikarp? Where's the Magikarp salesman? All right. Do I want to buy the Magikarp, guys? Let me get a. I'll, I'll, let me pull up a poll. Alex Winterfox, I appreciate you hanging out. Have a fantastic night. Can we get some good nights in the chat for Alex Winterfox? We will catch you next time, my friend. I appreciate you stopping by, checking out the stream today. And we'll see you later. Have a fantastic night.
All right, looks like everybody's telling me to buy the fish, so we will buy the fish. Rich Pet paid an outrageous $500 and bought the Magikarp. Do I want to give a nickname to the Magikarp? Yes. We're gonna name the Magikarp... Hmm. What should I name the Magikarp? I feel like I should name it something different than the regular theme, just because of how outrageous this one is. I would name it Viri, but we're saving Viri for the first Eevee we find. Name it Chopsticks? Sushi? I could just name it Splash. Magikrap. Dragonite. No, I wanna- I, I, I don't wanna name it after another Pokemon. I'll name it- we can name it Sushi. Alright, we will catch you next time. Have a fantastic night. Alright, everybody voted by the fish. Question for Rogue. Um, the only Rogue that is worth it is the Swiftfoot Rogue, uh, Lacerte. Swiftfoot is the only one that I would suggest... Um, Doing. None of the other ones are, are even close to as good as Swiftfoot is. Alright, let's work on this cave here. Got a Zubat. Uh-oh. I forgot. We're just going to run into Zubats for the rest of our lives. Alright, we killed the first one. Yeah, Lacerte, once you get to level 30, you're able to unlock a duplicate and get a um, a second of the same unit. I have both of mine as... both of my rogues as Swiftfoot, because there's nothing else that's even close to as um, useful as Swiftfoot. There's a few units that you can kind of go with two of the three options. There's not. I don't think there's any that all three of them are particularly good. Um, but it's pretty much universally accepted that Swiftfoot Rogues are the best options. Glass Iris. Let's see, let's see. We'll go with Metal Claw, let's see what we can do here. Oh, am I going to bed? Nap time. I don't think I have an awakening. No, I don't. Alright, we'll just spam smoke screen. We'll see if Clefairy can do any damage to us. If it does, then we'll switch out. If not, then we'll just kind of sit here. Napping. Hey, Clefairy is pretty cute. Oh, well, hi, Kaya. Are you awake now? Did you guys hear Kaya sneeze? I'm getting slapped. Oh, I missed. Very missed. Alright, no harm, no foul. What ghosty? What I do? What I do? Oh, hi, Kaya. The fight went fairly well, didn't it? Yes, yes, it did. Yeah, I don't want to shoot out either, Viri. I hope the game ends. I I actually have it open on my on my uh, phone right now, so I have it on the side. 
but I'm 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 pretty far behind, so I don't know what uh, what's happening. Head north, turn right, past the ladder, stick to the wall, go to the southwest. Oh, that was a pretty bad breakaway. Yeah, that wasn't even close. There's another trainer down here. Ember. We'll just keep setting Zubats on fire. The beard is distracting his gameplay. No, I think the beard is distracting you. Very. I don't think I don't think anybody else is distracted by the beard. Ah, <laughs> I snuck up on him. But Blackwood's uh, pretty good, uh, pretty good goalie. Like I told you, I actually saw Mackenzie Blackwood play in person a couple of years ago, back when he played in the AHL. Um, I think I think he beat my team that night. Yeah, that was actually... So I went to this AHL game, right? About a month before... No, I'm not going to change Pokemon. Uh, about a month before the game, I wanted to get tickets. And I was having problems getting them online. Or, or I think they had like a special or something. So if I if I called them, I'd be able to get the special. And they weren't offering it online. So I called them in the morning, and I'm like, Hey, can I get the tickets? They, they say, sure. They, um... They charge my credit card. And I get like a, I don't, I don't get any confirmation or anything, but it was over the phone, so I wasn't expecting it. So I get there the day of, and they tell me they're, they're going to be at will call. I get there, and they don't have my, my tickets. Apparently, they had charged my card, but they never actually saved the tickets for me. And by the time I got there, the seats that I had bought had been sold literally 10 minutes before I got there. It was, it was ridiculous. So, I had gotten front row seats specifically because my my team from Massachusetts was playing in New York. Like, I, I lived in New York. Um, so I went to go see them play there. And... I don't know, it was a mess. Luckily, they, they, they gave me some free ticket vouchers, so I was able to go back and... Um... I was able to go back and go to another game for free. Yeah, Veer, you can post links. These bug catchers are really easy to just use Ember on. Is that a picture of his beard, Viri? Yeah, okay. <laughs> All right, you guys will have to tell me how the shootout's going as uh, as it happens, because I'm, I'm so far behind you guys. I'm like 30 to 45 seconds behind. Schmibbles' head, because I think Schmibbles is watching on actual TV. Oh, there's so many Zubats. Got an escape rope. That's good. So ghosty so they're they played um three periods the game was tied so they're going to overtime they play a five minute five minute overtime period nobody scored so now it's going to a shootout so each team has three players that each get a chance to take one shot if um whoever has the most points in the shootout after those three shots wins if it's still tied 
they go one player at a time until somebody scores. Um, if your team scores, the other team has a chance to kind of counter. But if they don't score, then your team wins. Hockey's a lot of fun. I I love watching hockey. Ooh, we, this is the introduction to Team Rocket, guys. We have not seen Team Rocket yet. This is Sand Shrew. If I remember correctly, our Ember was decent against the Sand Shrew last time. Yeah. Ruins win, Marshawn scored, nice. Was it three rounds already, Schmibbles? They didn't let Paul be score, oh no. They didn't let the beard, they didn't let the beard play. It's rigged. Still remember when the Canes won the Stanley Cup? Oh yeah. Yeah, Carolina is pretty cool. I like their storm surges. They've they've gotten very popular. If they had let him play, we would have won. Well, they didn't, and you didn't. So, so, just saying, just saying. Should I try to catch a Zubat, guys? I guess we can try. Viri, I know something that'll make you feel better, even though your team lost. I know something that'll make you feel better. You can type cute, cute dog in the chat, and it'll show you a cute dog emote. It forms colonies in perpetually dark places and uses ultrasonic waves to identify and approach targets. You have a nickname to the captured Zubat? Sure. We'll name the Zubat... Caterpie. Doesn't make you as happy as the beard. Found a star piece. Perfect. Alright, I think we need to head up. There's nowhere else to go from here. I'm a little upset that we couldn't keep Caterpie in our party. We had to send Caterpie right to the box. Oh no, I'm confused. Don't hurt yourself. No! Come on, Pat. You can do this. Alright, we were able to use Metal Claw. That works. Alright, let's get out of this cave. Let's see. Head north from the ladder. That's the next step. Oh my gosh, so many Zubats. Oh no, this isn't a Zubat this time. I should have stocked up on repels before we came in here. Up this way. Oh, I'm actually surprised Scratch did that much damage. I know I'm level 22, but still. Misty's staring at you from down the hallway. Let's figure out what she wants. Anybody that doesn't know, Misty is our cat. Our black cat. 
Oddish. Hello, Oddish. Meet Ember. Super effective. Bellsprout. We haven't seen a Bellsprout yet. I really probably should let my other Pokemon get some, uh, get some experience here. Misty wants me home so I can give her treats. Yeah, that sounds about right. Team Rocket is here to battle with me again. Uh, don't forget anybody who's been hanging out in the chat tonight. We have our new sound effects. If you do exclamation SFX, you'll get a link to the website where you can redeem sound effects, or you can get a list of all of the ones that are currently available. You can use your channel points to redeem for sound effects. There's a new alert that pops up on the screen, too, if you use those, if you haven't seen them yet. Hey, Daniela! Welcome on back. If anybody is not in our Discord, you can do exclamation Discord as well. There is now a channel dedicated exclusively to pictures of Daniela's bird, Coco. It is a very good channel, if I do say so myself. You should go check it out. Let's see, I think we need to go down this way. Tata. All right, we use Metal Claw this time. Did you put a video of Misty screaming? Oh no, I missed. Oh, that didn't do it. That barely did any damage. Come on in. Yeah, I'm already level 22. I've I've only been using my Charmander. Um, I do have a full I do have a full party, but I've I've basically only been using Charmander. Uh, if you are interested, we have five other Pokemon in the party. We have Growlithe. Machoke, Jolteon, Pidgey, and Sushi. Oh, I shouldn't have used that. Yeah, no, our, our theme is whenever we catch a Pokemon, we need to name it another Pokemon name that is not that Pokemon. Except for Sushi. Sushi's the Magikarp that we bought from the Magikarp salesman. Ooh, Onyx might be tough. We had trouble. uh, maybe not. It's a lot lower level than Brock's Onyx. Ooh, we almost one-shot it. Glad it didn't use Rock Tomb. Can't post the video, it's too big. Uh, yeah, you need to have um, 
the Discord, was it Nitro, in order to post videos for the most part. We found a Moonstone. There's a Grandma Orc Slayer. Where? Let's see. Oh, there is. That's amazing. That's, um... Oh, that's a Sixation skin. That's the same person that has our Goose skin. Oops. What's that what, Schmibbles? Oh, uh, Nitro? It's a subscription, so you need to pay for it. I think it starts at $5 a month. Uh-oh, I'm paralyzed. Yeah, no worries, Viri. School comes first. Get your lab work done. We'll catch you later. I should probably play in Sixation's battles more often. Or at least just stick around with, um... Well, actually, we're going to be heading out in a few minutes, Viri, when Dogfish goes live. So we'll see you over on Dogfish, Dogfish's stream. Let's see. Make a right to meet the third Team Rocket member. Oh, Dogfish isn't going live today? Oh, did I miss an announcement? Did I miss an announcement? He posted it somewhere and I just missed it. Hmm. Where did he say that? Oh. It was right after when I messaged him. Never mind. Never mind. I just missed the announcement because he he responded to my message at the same time, so it, it cleared the notifications. Anyway, well, hey, now we can hang out for like another hour, guys. That's exciting. I don't have to ditch you all now. That also means let's uh let's let's pull up stream raiders real quick. Let me see how far away one two. We might be able to do this token chest tonight, guys. We only have two more battles until the token chest. If we don't lose any battles, we'll be able to do the token chest tonight. I think. And the token chest will be good, because that way everybody can get some bonus um, tokens event progression for their battle passes. Oh no, I'm paralyzed. I don't have any, uh, paralyzed heals or anything. I really should have stocked up on items before I came in here. I think I'll use a... I think I'll use a potion. Oops. My bad. My bad! Sorry, I forgot that I had even... I forgot that I switched it over. Professional streamer, guys. Professional streamer. Use one more. Moving on, moving on. Geo dude. Oh, I'm paralyzed still. Oh, he pinched me, guys. Geo dude pinched me. Uh, yeah, I'm using a Game Boy emulator, Gravy. As fun as it would be to play it on Game Boy and have a capture card running from it, I don't, I don't uh, have one of those, and I can imagine they're probably pretty expensive. Leech life doesn't really do anything at this point.
Leveled up again, perfect. All right, we got about a minute and a half left to place troops on Stream Raiders. One last reminder before we get that started. I don't get why it's using Leech Life first. Are there any other good stream raids going on at the moment? Um, I don't have my viewer account open right now, to be completely honest. Um, I, I got all the tokens that I needed earlier in the day, so I decided to take a break this afternoon. Um, but a couple people you can look out for. Um, William Eagle is another captain that's in our community. Um, he's a friend of ours. He's also plays with Dogfish. Um, check him out if he's online. He goes through battles pretty quickly, so you can get some pretty decent loot from him. He's offline right now. Um, you could also check out um, Maku PhD. They're uh, they're another bigger Stream Raiders captain that I like playing with. Uh, I think Obi's offline. Mike and Chill usually streams, but he's probably offline now. But I'd say I wouldn't bother with him. Um, Priddle Craddle is always a good one. And... Well, I'm paralyzed and confused. Yeah, Hooks is always on. I have a hard time getting loot out of Hooks' battles, though, just because his his um his battles are so big. Hold on, I'm pulling up on my phone right now, my Stream Raiders account, so I can see who's online and give you, give you some actual suggestions. Yep, we were just finishing that Pokemon battle, and it is. Stream Raiders time, let's get this battle started. 48 allies, 27 enemies. Holy crap, guys, these are getting to be some pretty big battles. There's a lot going down, though. But we still got the win. No problem. Let's open that up. We got seven gold going to everybody who participated in that battle. One viewer is getting 50 bonus gold. One viewer is getting two bomber scrolls on the leaderboard. In first place, we got Lacerte. Six kills, two assists. Impossible Fig in second with seven kills. And freaking Undissolved. Third place, four kills. Loot is going to Dan Daniela and Lacerte. Congrats on that loot. It is treasure trove time see what we got here. We'll need some ranged units. Don't place right up on the front. Give them a little bit of space, but I'd suggest get some ranged in there. We'll also need a little bit of melee to try to take care of those dragons. And don't bother placing in the back. Oh, don't bother placing in the back. You can head on over to streamraiders.com slash t slash reachpat. Place your troops every five minutes. We'll get the battle started in half an hour. All right, let me pull up my thing here. So um, if you're looking to play with people that we know, you can go to Mr. Ortiz 2006. Um, Mr. Ortiz is a friend of the community, friend of Dogfish. Um, he is currently streaming and is live. Uh, Criddle Craddle is a good captain to be with. Uh, I also like Grandma's Cookies. Um, they're a fun streamer to hang out with. Uh, Grandma's Cookies, it's Grandma's and with a Z. The G-R-A-N-D-M-A-Z. And then C-0-0-K-I-E-S. Um, I'd suggest going with those captains if you're looking for somebody to play with. See, I think there's. Oops. Found these fossils. Uh oh. Do we got? Do we go with um? Do we go with the helix fossil guys? 
we go with Helix for the memes? Or do we go with Dome? Ooh, I probably should have healed up before this battle. I think we have to go with um, the Helix Fossil. We're playing Pokemon on Twitch. Even though you guys aren't playing, it's Pokemon Plays Twitch. We gotta go with the Helix Fossil. Stick with our Pokemon. I'm almost out of PP on uh, my Ember. I need to get back to a Pokemon Center, but I don't want to do this whole uh, this whole cave over. We're almost to the end of the cave. I think this is pretty much it. Helix Fossil, yes. I got a Geo Dude. Fossil, no helix. Like a twisty. In case you're not aware, the helix fossil is a meme back from Twitch Plays Pokemon a few years back. Um, Twitch Plays Pokemon was a chat interactive Pokemon game that they played the original Pokemon game uh, where the character on screen would move based on what people were inputting in the chat and they picked the helix fossil and it became a meme I don't know all the lore of it um, but I do know that he was referred to as Lord Helix and he was the savior and I think there was a Pidgeotto or a Pidgeot that was a false prophet or something like that there's a whole if, if you look it up on YouTube there's a whole there's a whole thing. I don't know all the lore. I'm not even going to bother trying to explain it because I'm going to mess it up and somebody's going to get mad at me. Hey. Hey, Bill. Are you Bill? No, you're not Bill. Who's Bill? I don't think you're Bill. But actually, right now, there's somebody that is playing, um... They're playing Pokemon through their Twitter profile pictures. So there's certain ways to input commands into their Twitter profile. I don't have a million dollars. Interesting. Okay, hold on. So this emulator that I'm using will let me import Game Shark data. Should I get a Game Shark and give myself a million coins so I can circumvent the story and buy the bike through the shop? I'm not going to, but it'd be funny. Maybe I can do like an alternate save and do it that way. People here were robbed. Team Rocket is behind this most heinous crime. 
Even our police force has trouble with the rockets. Can we go up and across the bridge yet? Ah, it's Nate. Yo, Reach, you're still struggling all along back here? I'm doing great. I caught a bunch of strong and smart Pokemon. Here, let me see what you caught, Reach. Welcome back, Nate. Prepare to lose. Level 17 Pidgeotto. Psh, that's nothing for my level 24 Pat. Nate's trying to attack me. Oh no, my attack missed. Oh, puny 8 HP damage. Nothing. That's nothing. Oh no, I, I missed again. I'm... Oh. Okay, maybe, maybe I am in trouble. I've lost three moves in a row now. Nate, you're being mean to me. Alright, we leveled up. Uh, Nate, if I... If I lose... This battle... You're banned. I'll never I'll never be able to forgive you. Oh no, that does nothing. I just keep using withdraw. I'm okay with that. As long as you don't use a water move. Ugh. No. Yikes. I think we're actually gonna lose this. Let's let's try a different strategy. We're gonna put in our Jolteon. Oh no, Jolteon's gonna die. Poor Jolteon. I was hoping to electrocute you. My choke? I think this is a losing battle, guys. Growlithe? Maybe I shouldn't focus all of my attention on the one Pokemon that's weak against my rival. Oh. Alright, we got we got one move in. It's progress. Gone for sand attack, maybe. Nothing I do does damage. All right, we're just gonna see if I can out outrun outrun the inevitable death here. Don't kill me, don't kill me. Oh, 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 oh. All right, Pidgey, it's your turn. Oh no. All right, it's down to Sushi. Come on, Sushi. The problem with all of this is there's still more Pokemon on Nate's team. Alright. It's down to Pat. Please do something that doesn't attack. No! I still have two more Pokemon to go through, though.
and, I, uh, and I'm out of potions. Yes, keep using Teleport Abra. Alright. Who are we down to? Just a Rattata? Oh, this'll... Oh. Oh no. Okay, Quick Attack doesn't do any damage. Yes! Guys, we did it! Take that, Nate! Hey, guess what? I went to Bill's and got him to show me his rare Pokemon. That had a lot of pages to my Pokedex. After all, Bill's world famous as a Pokemaniac. He invented the Pokemon storage system on PC, too. Since you're using his system, you should go to thank him. Well, better get rolling. Smell you later. Bye, Nate. Oh. Oh, yeah, right. I feel sorry for you. No, really. You're always plotting behind me. So here, I'll give you a little present as a favor. We got a fame checker. Chatty gossip like you? That thing's perfect. I don't need it because I don't give a hoot about others. Alright, this time I really am gone. Smell ya. Yeah, I remember that Bill's in it around. Alright, we're gonna go heal up. Definitely need to do that at this point. Alright, Shibbles, have a fantastic night. Thanks for stopping in. I appreciate you hanging out. We will catch you next time. Have a good sleep. Enjoy your coffee tomorrow. And we're going to go to the store and buy a bunch of items because I used them all in that battle. Super potions, perfect. We'll take ten of those, we'll take, we'll take, we'll take three of those. They're kind of expensive. No, I don't need any Pokeballs. We'll get four of those. We'll get an antidote. Get a paralyzed heal. We get an awakening. And I think we're good for now. Oops. Alright, I think I should probably actually rearrange my party a little bit. If we go to the PC here. I have a higher level Zubat in the PC. Let's see, I think we'll switch out Caterpie. I want to switch it out for Jolteon here, but Jolteon we probably should keep for the Water Gym coming up. I am going to lose to the water gym. Maybe I'll switch it out for not... I should probably switch it out for sushi. If I'm being honest, because sushi's not going to be able to do anything for us. Is it gym time? I'll go through these trainer battles just to try to get some more experience. I probably should have put my Jolteon in the number one spot and then just swapped out immediately. Okay, so that's not very good. Bubble's gonna do some damage to me. Not too much, because I'm nine levels higher. Let's see, what's the strategy here? That worked, that worked. All right, you know what, guys? Who's up Who's up for something right now? We got, we got 13 people hanging out in the chat right now. Trying to set something up real quick.
I'm feeling, I'm feeling like giving away a sticker tonight. Exclamation raffle in the chat if you would like to enter for a shiny holographic tiger head logo sticker. You don't need to be subbed, you just need to be following the channel to enter. Completely free. We'll be giving out one of these tonight. We just got them in the other day. They look pretty cool. If you wanna check out what they look like, you can do exclamation sticker. Stickers? I think it's stickers in the chat. That'll bring you right to our sticker store. You can check out what else we have to offer. Not very effective, but that was still pretty good. Wavy's actually going to study. Jolteon leveled up. Jolteon leveled up again. We defeated the swimmer. Nice. I think that's what I need to do. I need to put... I need to put Jolteon... here. And I'll put... at... here. That way I can just swap train Jolteon. You already know everything, you're just doing practical. Practice is good. What, uh, what are you studying right now, Gwavy? It'll be nice once I get the, um, EXP share. Let's see, it said fire's power was weakened. I just want to see how much damage, yeah. That Okay. I think it was better against the uh, the last Pokemon because it's part Ice type. Living environment, or living environment, or living environment. All right, defeated the Goldeen. Perfect. Jolteon leveled up. Jolteon learned Tail Whip. I guess it just depends on the context. Did I break your brain? I'm sorry, I didn't mean to break your brain. Right, yes, heal please. I think before we go to Misty, we should probably... So is it like a bio class, like a biology type class, or is it like a, like a, like about the home? All right, we'll do the bridge here, go against all these trainers. Bug catcher Kale. See, I don't know if, Earth science? Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, that's, that's that's kind of what I meant when I, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're on the same page. That's what I was thinking, too. I just couldn't think of the right terminology to use. I am getting kind of sleepy. I don't know, I might, um, I might actually end the stream after this next Stream Raiders battle, and then we'll save the next two, let me check real quick, we're still, we're still two battles away from the green chest, yeah, I might just end stream, end stream after the next Stream Raiders battle, and then we'll pick up one battle before the green chest, that way if anybody's a little behind. 
That would be, let's see, on Sunday, it would have to be for the green chest because tomorrow is Stream Raiders versus, so we're going to be doing that all day. And then we'll be doing Among Us as well. Yeah, unfortunately, I still have to work tomorrow, so I probably should get some sleep. Jolteon leveled up, and learned Thunder Wave. Yeah, Street Raiders versus tomorrow. We got a chance to win two gaming monitors. So if we if we win um, if we win some gaming monitors, then we'll be raffling those off to the community. Uh, we'll also have. I think there's gaming headsets. I think there's keyboards, a few other rewards, Amazon gift cards. Oh yeah, don't forget to join the raffle if you haven't joined this raffle yet, exclamation raffle in the chat. We'll be picking the winner in a few minutes here. Yeah, so I I work full time um, 7 a.m. to 3 p.m. Monday through Friday. And then on Saturday afternoons, I work at my other job, um, which is at a laser tag place. Um, and I just do that job for fun. I, I enjoy working there. Um, I've worked there for... Uh, actually, in three weeks, although I've been there for three years, which is crazy. So actually, yesterday was my three-month work anniversary at my, or my, yesterday was my six-month work anniversary at my full-time job, and then in three weeks it'll be my three-year anniversary at the laser tag place. So I'm hitting a bunch of work anniversaries. Jolteon level up. All right, so I'm poisoned. I probably should fix that. Um, but yeah, so I typically work Saturday afternoons there, and then I have Sundays off. But occasionally, um, the laser tag place that I work at, they have cash tournaments for laser tag. So every, the first Sunday of every month, um, you can come and play, and if you've qualified for the tournament, you have a chance to win a cut of $1,000 just for playing laser tag, which is crazy. Um, but I am the tournament director for the place that I work at, so... I have to work on those Sundays whenever they happen. And now typically I ask them to uh, let me not work on that Saturday, but I I, uh, I think they might have lost the note that I had sent saying, hey, don't schedule me on the Saturday if you're scheduling me on the Sunday, because then at that point I'll be working uh, two weeks straight without a break. That's no fun. But that's only once a month when it does happen, so it's not a huge deal. Just a little annoying because then I don't get any rest, but... Bellsprout's about to come out. Ah, uh, no, we'll just, we'll just stick with Pat and, and this fight. We got time for one more trainer battle, and this is going to be our last one for the night, I believe. Alright, we're going to 
change out. I need to pick a KK Slider song, guys. I didn't pick one out before stream. I've run out of, uh, I've run out of new songs. I'm gonna have to start playing duplicates now. Until, uh, Clay Kramer starts coming out with, uh... Until Clay Kramer... Until Clay Kramer comes out with a new one. KK Horn. Horn! Got about two and a half minutes left. Place down your last couple of troops. That was a quick battle. We got time for another one. Don't forget to enter into the raffle, guys. We'll be picking the winner right after the Stream Raiders battle. Exclamation raffle in the chat if you'd like to enter. Another Nidoran. I remember having a lot of trouble going over this bridge when I was younger. Oh no, I got poisoned. That's going to cause some trouble. Number five. Messing around with your Wii earlier trying to homebrew it, and all of a sudden the disk drive blue light is just on. Is it like the blue light of death? light that turns on when you insert a disc. Interesting. That's weird. Weird why it would still be on. Alright, we won this battle. We'll get to Stream Raiders in just a second. As soon as I can get this battle ended on here. Perfect. We defeated Camper Ethan. Alright, let me pause this. We'll head over to Stream Raiders, get this battle started up. This is our last battle of the night, guys. We got 51 allies on the battlefield. That's crazy. There's quite a few allies. We're gonna go and attack these dragons. Looks like everybody's cleaning up the loot with all of those treasure chests in the back. And just that last dragon to go. And that is it. Let's open up this chest, see what we got. We got Seven gold going to everybody who participated in that battle. One viewer is getting two monk scrolls. One viewer is getting two centurion scrolls. On the leaderboard, we got Deep Driller in first. Ten assists, Lacerte in second with five... Or ten kills, sorry. Lacerte in second, five kills, and Nugs in third. One kill, four assists. Loot is going to Ghosty and Daniela. Congratulations on that bonus loot. Now, before we end for the night, we'll switch over to our ending screen here. Uh, let me get the credits rolling.
and then we will pick our raffle winner. Remember, now is your last chance if you'd like to enter for a Reach Pat sticker, a brand new shiny holographic sticker, exclamation raffle in the chat. I am going to close the entries. Entries are no longer open. And the winner is Dead Yella. Congrats on the sticker. I will get that in the mail to you. I will get that in the mail in the next couple of days. Uh, but yeah, congrats. All right, everybody, that is going to wrap up the stream today. I appreciate everybody coming and hanging out, trying out a new game today. We haven't played this game on stream yet. We haven't played it, uh, I mean, at all, really. Um, but I hope you all enjoyed. Uh, yeah, we will be live tomorrow. Tomorrow we will be doing... What are we doing tomorrow? We're doing Stream Raiders versus to start the stream. We'll be doing Among Us after that. Uh, so if you'd like to join us, we'll be going live around 8 o'clock Eastern. We got 10 days until my birthday stream. If you want more information on that, exclamation birthday in the chat or head into our Discord. We'll be dropping a raid over to a streamer. We have not raided them yet, uh, but we know them from Dog Fish's community. Uh, the streamer is It's Nicole B. They're playing some Animal Crossing. Looks like they just found Maple, and they're working on making a rock garden on their island. Um, but yeah, for now, we are going to head out for the night. I appreciate all of the support, as always. Have a fantastic night, everybody, and we will catch you all next time. For now, we're going to end with some KK Slider, as we usually do. Catch you all later.